This is the fourth video in the Playground Design project. In the previous video, we completed the main platform. In this video, we are going to create the triangular platform. So we can see that our triangular platform has a 46 by 44 inch side. We have a six inch and 7.75 lines coming off of it. They don't give us the uh, angled or our hypotenuse here. Uh, as long as you draw the outside of this, we can join these two points and don't need to know the length of that line. So moving over to Onshape, I'm going to create my triangular platform. Again, housing everything in my playground design folder. I'm going to create a sketch. I'm going to lay that on the top of the uh, top plane and orientate myself. So I'm going to grab my line tool and I'm going to start with a six inch line. From there, at 90 degrees, I'm going to make a line going to the right at 44 inches. Again, being a larger part, I need to keep orientating myself. I'm going to create a line going down at 90 degrees at 46 inches. Then I'm going to create a line coming to the left at 7.75 inches. And again, I don't need to know the length of this hypotenuse uh, because I can just click my points. And I have that uh, blue shading saying I have a closed sketch. And again, all these dimensions are included on this orthographic drawing. My extrusion on this, just like the main platform, is going to be three inches. So I'm going to change my extrusion here to three inches. And we can see that I have the beginnings of my triangular platform. I'm going to lay a sketch on the top. And I need to put holes in now. And if we take a look, we're dealing with four inch holes. There's three of them. And just like the previous ones, they're uh, four inches away from the corners. So I'm going to grab my circle tool. I'm going to make a four inch circle. Four inch circle. And again, I'm roughly placing these where I'd like them to be. And we will dimension them to where we need them to be. So I have my dimension tool here, the center of my circle to the line here on the left, four inches, and center to here, four inches. We're also going to go from here to here, four inches, here to here, four inches. So we have our holes that are four inches away from each side. Next, I'm going to come up here to my extrude button. I'm going to gain a perspective just to show you. Now I want to remove material again, and I want to remove three inches of material. My green check mark to complete. And we can now see I have my completed triangular platform according to specifications. Because we're dealing with numerous parts again, we want to come here and rename this triangular platform. Again, making sure that we're saving all these documents in our playground design folder. 